everyone, this is Caroline from Diabetes Obesity Clinic and today we're going to be learning 5 little adjustments that you can make to your everyday life to control your portions and avoid overeating. The first adjustment is to avoid the out of sight, out of mind problem and this is by using, always using see-through containers such as this. How many times has it happened to you that you've been munching on a box of cookies or a bag of, a bag of chips and before you know it you've reached the bottom of the bag and you've eaten all the chips. Well, by using see-through containers, you can actually control how many chips or how many snacks you've been, you've been eating. Uh, and you can, you can not only use these plastic containers, but also use these plastic Ziploc bags. And this thing is great not only to have portion control, but to also plan your meals beforehand and your snacks. And have you ever wondered why McDonald's uses red and yellow colors as their company colors? It's because red and yellow, those bright colors, actually trigger your appetite. Well, by using plates in colors such as blue, purple, and gray, you can, also, you can actually suppress that appetite and that'll make you eat a little bit less. Before surgery, patients might be used to eating large portion sizes and may feel a little bit anxious or a little bit uncomfortable when realizing that their plates now carry smaller sizes. What you can do to ease yourself to smaller portions is actually purchasing smaller plates. The good thing here is that when the same amount of food is placed in a big plate and a small plate, our brain immediately registers that as a smaller plate contains more food. The fourth adjustment is mindful snacking. And this is just taking a moment when you feel that, that pang of hunger to assess if it is really hunger or if it's just boredom, anxiety, or if you just need a quick break. 15 seconds to 30 seconds can, can be enough to actually just know if you're hungry or not. And the last adjustment is getting enough sleep. Midnight snacks have to be a thing of the past. Lack of sleep can also affect your appetite and make you crave high calorie foods. It can also affect your energy levels, which is crucial for a bariatric patient that, that needs to keep up with their exercise routine. It does take some time to get used to this new lifestyle, but soon it will become second nature to you. Use these small tips to make your body and your mind work together towards a common goal, which is your health. And remember, if you're ready to make this life-changing decision, and know if you're qualified for bariatric surgery, just call our patient coordinators. We're here to help and be with you every step of the way. Bye-bye.